It was a dark and stormy night, but inside Macy's Herald Square, things were decidedly bright. Okay, okay, I promise, no more intentional rhyming for the rest of this video. On October 13th, 2022, I was invited to a special preview party at the new Toys R Us opening October 14th in New York City. Special thanks to the folks at WHP Global for their generous invite to this event. Last year, I took you on a walkthrough of the Toys R Us in the American Dream Mall in East Rutherford, New Jersey. This time, I'll be taking you inside the newest Toys R Us store at Macy's Herald Square in New York City. An important note. During the event, there was a DJ playing full-on party music, so I'll be substituting the audio of the party with background music to prevent any copyright strikes from YouTube. Macy's stores were originally opened in 1858 by Roland Husey Macy as R.H. Macy & Co. However, it would not occupy its iconic flagship location in Herald Square until 1902. Even then, the store went through continuous structural expansion until 1931. Since then, it has been added to the National Register of Historic Places and was designated a National Historic Landmark in 1978. Its last major renovation was in 2015, but it continues to be modified to this day to fit the style of the time. Even if you have never visited this specific Macy's before, the store and its famous Thanksgiving Day Parade have been a part of American pop culture for decades. There is, of course, the classic Miracle on 34th Street film from 1947 and its various remakes. It has also been referenced or appeared in many TV shows and movies, including 1993's We're Back, A Dinosaur Story, the 1966 program Man From U.N.C.L.E., The Simpsons, Family Guy, and even the Muppets. This new store is not the first collaboration between Macy's and Toys R Us. After WHP Global acquired Toys R Us back in 2021, they began to open several smaller Toys R Us sections in Macy's stores around the country starting in July through October of 2021. Indeed, Herald Square itself had a Toys R Us section during the 2021 holiday season right next to its famous Santa's workshop. This new Toys R Us takes up about 14,000 square feet on the seventh floor of Macy's Herald Square. That's not the entire floor, but it's a large chunk of it. And this is reflected in not only the variety of product they carry, but also the experiences they offer to kids and parents. Kids will no doubt get a kick out of the play area that includes a creative take on iconic New York City sites, such as the Washington Square Arch, a taxi cab, a water tower, and the bridge. Kids and adults alike can take a picture with Jeffrey on a park bench or with a Lego Statue of Liberty. If you want to see something really impressive, there's a gigantic Lego display featuring the Thanksgiving and Christmas parades with a ton of Lego people watching set against the backdrop of the Macy's store itself in Lego form. Other photo op areas include Paw Patrol, Thomas the Tank Engine, and Barbie. 
kids will have a great time visiting this location. Toys R Us kid, this is the place for you. The selection of toys is wide and features a ton of popular brands. Barbie, Gabby's Dollhouse, Paw Patrol, Bluey, Hot Wheels, Fisher Price, Lego, and more have a significant presence in this store. Unlike the store in the American Dream Mall, I was very happy to see a section devoted to action figures. Star Wars, Marvel, and Transformers each had sections featuring toys for younger fans all the way to older collectors like Black Series, Marvel Legends, and Transformers Generations. I really hope to see these sections continue and if possible expand in the future.
So how, you may wonder, was the party? I have to say, I've never attended a catered party inside a Toys R Us store before, so this was a first. There were all sorts of small bites, including sliders and pizza, along with two full bars. A DJ played music that really helped keep the energy level up. Towards the end of the party, they even served dessert in the form of cute little mini ice cream cones and sandwiches. Everyone, grown-ups and kids alike, were having a great time, whether they were talking business or what toys were their favorites or taking pictures. There were several stations set up, giving away goodies or showing off products. It was a wonderfully festive event. Toys R Us in Macy's Herald Square is open now. Starting on October 15th, the store will be holding a series of events to celebrate its opening and Jeffrey's birthday. These events include Barbie Day on October 15th, Fisher Price Day on October 16th, Jeffrey's birthday on October 17th, and many more. A full list of events is below in the video description.
Thanks again to the kind folks at WHP Global for their invite to this event. And thank you, dear viewer, for watching this video. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. If you like what I do on this channel, please consider subscribing. Kind comments are always appreciated. I now have a Patreon, which is linked below. Patrons help me generate content such as the video you are watching and the posts on Ben's World of Transformers. Thank you for joining me for this special event, and I hope you join me for future videos.